you cannot make these calves suck. They have got to find it on their own. So, just like last year, we're picking up another bottle calf that needs a home. Um, for some reason, the mom didn't claim it, whatever. And we just have it in, uh, the, 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 those clear plastic totes come in these cages. And we have that in the back of our Kawasaki mule. And that's how we're gonna transport it uh, two miles, I guess. <laughs> so, anyways, this guy is, had a little bit of a bottle but not a full one that he's used to so he is a little bit hungry um, but we gave him a little bit so that he wouldn't just completely gorge himself on our milk cow so we're gonna see we're gonna get her back home now and we're gonna see how that goes and uh, hopefully Belle doesn't mind too much and takes this little cafe on we know for sure she's got enough milk that's not an issue and we know this guy's hungry and he just wants a mommy so it, I'm hoping that it's going to work out really well. What do you think, little small fry? You're just sweet. Are you hungry? Are you hungry? Bring Belle up so that we can introduce her to her new baby, huh? Did you, did you need a mama? Are you little orphan Annie? Are you little orphan Annie? Aww, we're gonna get you some milk. Are you upset with us? It's all right. It's all right. So this is the first time introducing Belle to the new baby that we're going to draft on her. We did this last year and she fought it last year and I'm guessing she's going to fight it again because she doesn't have her little baby in here. So little guy's probably pretty hungry so he's going to know what to do, huh? Keep going little buddy. Keep going over there little buddy. There you go. She's not going to want anything to do with it because she knows it's not her calf. So how they end up being little orphans is that either their mom dies in birth or the mom might have twins and sometimes she'll just not own one. Okay, so we got this calf sucking now. And what will happen is, is um, Belle isn't fighting us. She, she knows it's not her calf though. She, she's well aware of that. But what's going to happen is... Um, we're gonna have to tie Bell up and let this calf suck for now. And then what we'll do, yeah, this, it's not on there. But what we'll do is we'll get it so that its poop smells like her milk. And she knows the smell of her milk. She's very well aware of what that's supposed to be like. And when this animal poops, it's gonna start smelling like Bell. And then Belle will have a lot easier time letting this calf be on at that point. But she's she's not Belle is not fighting us at all. She could be stomping and kicking and trying everything she can to get this calf away, but she isn't. You cannot make these calves suck. They have got to find it on their own. There he goes. And this calf knows how to suck, but it's been bottle fed for for a while. But Bella's Bella's being at least she's being decent with 
what's going on here. This is not natural for another calf to be sucking. Another thing is, we just got done feeding this calf uh, half a bottle minimum because if we didn't and and this calf just gorged on bell that would be a detrimental to this calf um, bell has huge fat content in her milk her milk is really um, it's just really good milk and not that this one isn't but there's just a lot of difference there another thing is that Bell doesn't like being tied up. I mean, we, we don't tie her up for any other reason but to do this. And we did this to her last year too. And so that's not normal to her at all. If we milk her, we put her in a little stanchion deal that we have and it sometimes close it around her or whatever. So, I mean, we, we haven't tied her up, but maybe 10, 12 times when we did it last year. Um, so th this just isn't really a very fun experience I guess for starting out but um, but this is better to to have her mad because she's tied up is better than to have her go ballistic on the calf and go crazy and sidestep the calf and kick the calf and whatever because she knows it's not right she knows it's not right now but she can't get her head around to sniff it really good to really verify things um, so so what our process is going to be through this is that we're even if she you know even if she just keeps doing this as good as she is now um we're, we're gonna go ahead and and um i'm gonna keep tying her up at least for a couple of days and then um and then we'll we'll let we'll let her go see she kicked there but anyways we'll, we'll let her go and um and then, and then after several days, we'll, we'll let it, oh, we'll let him figure foot. it out. Come help us milk in the morning. Yeah, great. See you at six in the morning. Oh, no, no thanks. What? I don't like getting up at six. Why? Seven thirty, right? Though. <laughs>